Uh, it's a samurai. Okay. What does it do? It's a mini robot. So. Okay. It may have finally sorted out the sensor that we couldn't get working. Oh really? We're just gonna test it out now and see what happens. All right. This is a sumo bot, right? Yeah. Okay. That looks fancy. We're a school from Saskatchewan. It's brought five mini sumo bots. Okay. The kids been working on in their spare time. Excellent. For the past three or four months. Okay. And well. What school? We're from Neilburg Compsis. Okay. He just east of Lloydminster. Oh, nice. Freedom bot. Okay. okay. He uh, has a couple of five by twelve timer boards there that are. Uh, giving us an analog signal to, to drive the servos and then a couple of, couple of bump sensors that kind of change the, the timing signal to reverse the servo. Oh nice! So he can climb up vertical walls, also he can go inverted, he can climb up uh, the surface that's upside down. Right. And uh, did there, yeah, bump into stuff. Sort of a reactionary robot. And you built this yourself? Uh, yeah. Cool. Yeah. So just modified a couple of uh, gadget gangster simple servo boards and uh, modified a few servos for continuous rotation. Now we have two classes. We have novice and we have master. And uh, we'll see, we'll see a lot of the, and we'll see some novice ones um, in the actual competition pretty soon. The novice ones tend not quite as good at the